Alright. Old school. Welcome to uh, another edition of the Hi, I'm Brad video blog. Uh, welcoming a guest, my roommate Timo. Hello. Best friend since we were five years old. Uh, freelance journalist, all around good guy. Uh, yeah. So today, I developed uh, a very new uh, celebrity crush. Oh, really? Yes. Uh, the fine Miss Katy Perry. That's that kissed a girl, right? Yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, her. Awesome. Awesome. She's okay, I guess. Yeah, her yeah. song's annoying. Catchy, but annoying. Totally catchy. No, there's a, I actually heard a couple other tunes, and they're pretty good. Do you have her album? No, but I will soon. Like, passion, like in five minutes? Are you going to go, like, jump right on iTunes and be like, bloop, buy it now? Yeah, maybe. That's cool. Maybe I will. <laughs> anyway. Uh, so, you know, that's what's going on with me. Katy Perry. She was a gospel singer, right? She was. Uh, For like how long? I, it was she a while. put out an album in 2001 under uh, Katy Hudson, which is uh, her real name. Oh. Um, but she, I guess she changed it. Uh, it's too close to Kate Hudson, something like that. But um, you know, she put out uh, like like a gospel album or like a Christian album, uh, mostly of songs she wrote, which you know, is always favorable. And it did nothing. I never heard of it. <laughs> you never heard of it. That's true. I'm sure lots of people never heard of it, but I mean that's kind of uh, kind of a pigeonhole, you know, Christian music. But um, you know, she's back on the scene. New album, uh, c completely different uh, marketing image. Uh, for sure. Yeah. It's a that's a far cry from Christian rock. There talking about uh, latent bisexuality. Yeah. But uh, no, that's that's kind of sad actually. <laughs> It's uh, it's kind of sad that she was doing her own thing, and that's cool, like, that someone was out there doing their own art, and, uh, it never did anything with it, and the only, she only gets going when there's, like, a $10 million marketing push behind her. Well, also, to be fair, she's only 24, so, uh... What does age have to do with that? Well, that would mean that, like, in 2001, she would have been, like, 16, 17. My colleague Culkin was five when he started, so... Yeah, but that guy's scary. Let's not even get into that. <laughs> All right. Alright, um, so, well, moving on, uh... Ooh, I want to talk about my blog. Okay. Um, I have a blog called Comma <coughs> Error. It's www.commaerror.blogspot.com. Everyone should check it out. I blog about incredibly geeky things like video games and the day in the life of a video store clerk and stuff like that, because that's what I do. It's so, true. check that out. It's, uh, lots of fun. Um, I haven't written on there since before Christmas, but I've been on vacation, so we got off my back. This is the, like the only guy who reads it, so he's been bugging me about it. Anyway, um, it yeah, so check that out, read. and uh, that's it for me. Out here. All right, well, Tim was out of here. Main bullet points to uh, take away from today's post is uh, www.comair.blogspot.com and uh, Katy Perry, what a babe.